Hello troops, and thanks for checking out this 0.61 experimental footage. This isn't my usual PvP type video, I thought I'd show you some footage of my uh, little adventures I've been having in 0.61. Well, there's a little bit of PvP at the end, but we'll save that. The video starts as we just arrive at Staroy. I'd been working my way up the map, um, picking up some bits and pieces, nothing too exciting. I decided to give the bow a bit of a go, and as you can see I, I am not a Robin Hood with the bow, I've not really used it for about a year or something. When you don't have a silenced pistol it's actually a very good way of clearing out towns of infected. Now it can be a little bit tricky. As you notice here there's different ways of shooting the bow, you can kneel or you can stand obviously, first person or third person. Now you may know that the bow's actually changed slightly. So there isn't actually a reticule when you're in first person, so it can be a little bit tricky to shoot infected from far away. Third person and reticule is there, but it seems to be much easier to fire now. Sharpened sticks usually won't kill an infected in one hit, so it's advisable to try and shoot the infected from maybe 20-30 metres away. That way, once they start running at you, you've got time to reload and shoot again, or back up and kind of run away a bit before they start laying into you. It really is quite fun to clear out a town in this way. I can heartily recommend it. Give it a go. It's great fun. So after clearing out the town of the majority of the infected, I headed along to the police station and I got one of my first interactions in 0.61. I was actually quite wary of these guys. I've had people try to tempt me out of places to kill me before and try the old, um, oh there's some ammo on the floor for you trick, while well, they shoot you in the head. Now the thing about 0.61 is when you're trying to inspect the floor for ammo, your screen goes all cloudy and blurry, so you can't tell if someone's taking a pistol out to shoot you. So that's definitely something to be aware of. Hello, dude. Hey, yeah. How are you doing? Very well in yourself. I'm good, thank you. I heard you frighten a chicken there. Yeah, I shot myself. I thought someone killed a chicken. I've been killing zombies around here with a bow and arrow. So, I take it you're friendly? I am friendly, yep. I take it you are, hopefully, as well? I am indeed. I've got a friend, yeah. How are you doing? I'm on the roof. My friend is, uh, I think, probably in the field behind you, so don't be alarmed. Okay. Right here, buddy. Right here. Hey, how you doing? Alright, how you doing, guys? I'll put my gun away. I'm I'm double carrying, but I'm, I won't shoot you. Okay, which way are you guys heading off to? We're looking for an IV starter kit. We're low on blood. Oh, I've not been into the hospital yet. I don't know if there is one in there. There's a scorpion in here, but there's no magazine. I'm not going to take it, so you're more than welcome to it. You guys get anything else you want to trade, perhaps? Uh, what are you after? Uh, I'm looking for some 9mm. I think we do. My friend is lagging, but I think we do have none. Uh, I could offer you a, a CR527 magazine. For the sniper rifle. Um, yeah, this, this is Winchester and he's got a Mosin. Uh, I don't have any Mosin ammo or spare Winchester ammo, I'm afraid. Have you got a uh, hunting scope? On my blaze, yeah, that's the only thing I've got. Alright, okay. I got some 308. 
We can give you ammo. We don't really need anything. All right, I'll, I'll come out. Did you hear my friend in game by any chance? I think I didn't know. Well, I heard him say hello, but yeah, I heard him say hello from up there. He's uh, dropped an ammo. All right, thank you. I mean, do you do you want to roll with us? Are you going to head over to Novi or something? Yeah, I can head up a little bit away with you. I'm not playing for very long, just another 10-15 minutes, but I'll, I'll head up with you if you want. Those are some nice sneakers you got there, dude. They're a bit white, aren't they? <laughs> quite bright. I'm digging the new sneakers in this game. Yeah, they're quite cool. I like them. I assume you're from Ireland. <laughs> I'm from Scotland. Oh, dude, that's the second time I've made that mistake. <laughs> A lot of people do. Ireland is fine, as long as you don't think I'm from England. <laughs> I'm glad you... I'm glad you said hello and didn't just shoot me from that roof. <laughs> it's experimental. I don't really do just kill on sight and experimental. People that want to try and explore and see new things, it's stables for PvP. And if I'm at a military area, then yeah, I'll PvP, but out in the wilderness, I don't, I don't bother PvPing, killing on sight. Yeah, it's a little different when you're at a military base or something. So unfortunately shortly after this the server was going down and I had to log off for the evening. Next day I logged back in and started to head my way down to Novi and got into my first proper PvP fight in point six one. Well, there's a dude there just heading into the police station. To keep an eye on him from out here. Heading round the back. See if we can intercept. Where the hell is he? Oh, there, zombies. He's seen me. What the? Where the fuck did these clothes go? Damn it! 
think we need to close the distance now. Nice stuff. Well, I hope you enjoyed that, guys. I would highly recommend giving the shotgun in any form, really. The double barrel, the pump action, anything. Just give it a go in 0.61. Uh, uh, at my experience so far, I've had a couple of more kills with it after this, and it's been bloody devastating. Maybe it needs a tweak, who knows, but I certainly will be using it again in the future. Take care guys, and I'll see you in the next one. Bye bye!